Hi, y'all. It's AGP here, and it's Wednesday. So you know it's time for another AGP video. <laughs> yep, so today, as you can see, this video is not very long. I'm going to put out a few videos today because we got some new stuff, including the gra first graphics look at the PS5. But this is just about Ghost of Tsushima. Now, it's Wednesday the 13th, so tomorrow is Thursday the 14th, and you know we're getting a state of play from Sony. The state of play will be at 1 p.m. Pacific time and 4 p.m. Eastern time, and it's going to be featuring Ghost of Tsushima, which is what, you know, we all want to hear, or at least I do for sure, and those of you who also do want to hear it because Ghost of Tsushima I think is going to be very good and according to Shu Yoshida from Sony Interactive Entertainment it could be in the running for game of the year which if you all saw my last video about Cyberpunk 2077 I was saying that will be in the running for game of the year I think but I also said that it will have competition and the competition I was referring to was Ghost of Tsushima, The Last of Us Part 2, Assassin's Creed, a few other titles too there that could possibly be coming out this year that will make Game of the year, whoever gets nominated and wins, very tough on critics this year because I think all of these will be very good and fun experiences. Y'all know, if y'all saw my last video about Ghost of Tsushima, I was telling y'all about the two different skill trees. The Samurai skill tree, which is about defense and walking around during the day, and the Ghost skill tree, which is about mostly being out at night and attacking and it has an, it's an attack based skill tree and is used for infiltrating camps and other enemy bands and whatever you want to call it. So tomorrow we're supposed to get 18 minute total look at Ghost of Tsushima. If y'all remember the last state of play, it really isn't very long. This state of play is really going to be Ghost of Tsushima essentially. And according to senior director Sid Schumann, you'll get an extended look at new gameplay footage, including exploration, combat, and more. The current cut is clocking in around 18 minutes, give or take, which I said. But he clarified that, just to be clear, there won't be any PS5 news or updates in this episode. Just a big, beautiful look at Sucker Punch's PS4 open world epic. So hopefully, you know, we get something really cool. We find out how this no waypoints thing is going to work. We get some more looks at some of the other environments in Ghost of Tsushima. I don't know if it's going to be like a side mission or just a demo they decided to make just for this state of play, but we will see. Y'all tell me down in the comments what you guys want to see. And if you see this video after you saw the state of play, tell me what your favorite part was. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to catch y'all next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to have, obviously, this on the channel. After I get it, I'm going to record it. We're going to, well, we'll talk about that later. I'm going to catch y'all next time, all right?